Brian Schifferling of Edgewood College Eagles.com here with Jake Nagus, who last night became the 19th Eagle to score 1,000 career points. Jake, first of all, take me through the play that you got 1,000 on. Um, to no one's surprise, the left-handed layup yeah. to the hole, but take me through the play. Um, I just came down in transition and got cut off, and then obviously I tried to get back to my left hand and just got downhill with my left hand and had a pretty easy layup to get to 1,000. But I had a couple shots before that. I only needed one point, so it was just trying to get that. Um, kind of tough at first. I missed my first couple shots, but finally got it and then eased in the rest of the game. Yeah, did you? it sounds like you knew coming into the night that you needed just a point. Does that change the approach at all coming into a game? Um, not really, especially only one, one yeah. point. Um, kind of knew I was going to get it um, eventually. Um, so being that it was only one point, it didn't really change my mindset or anything. This season has been a, a tough road for you early on. Um, you were out with some injuries, things like that. Yeah. What has this meant to you to, to get a thousand points, but just to be back on the floor playing with your team? It, mean, yeah, it means so much. Um, it's such a blessing to just be able to play. And up until this year, um, I've had great health and been able to play in every game. Um, and even this year, I've battled through a lot of stuff and just be able to come back and play for my team and hopefully make a push for the postseason at the end has just been great. Yeah, you got the, the most important thing last night, you guys got the win. Yeah. Um, what do you guys need to do here? You're obviously looking at the standings, just the game back now, but um, what is the goal the rest of the season? Um, the goal is just to take it one game, one game yeah. at a time. We have a big one on Saturday against Illinois Tech. Um, that's a huge one. And then Coach said earlier um, we had 10 games or 12 games left, and we need to go 2-1 and one in each quarter to probably make it. Um, so that's just our goal is going 2-1 and one in each quarter and just taking one game. At a time. Last year, you and Ben hosted an Eagle Eye, and you had the big free throw gate thing. Has there been a technical this year, and who got to take the he, technical free he's throws? He's taken almost every technical okay. free throw this right. year, and I don't know why. In the beginning of the season, coach would just pick him. Um, our percentages. He started out the season. He was like below fifty percent. Now I was giving him crap, saying that he was below fifty percent. Um, and now he's back up over eighty, and I'm close to eighty. But really, it doesn't matter as long as we knock him down. But Whenever he goes up to the line, I, I want him to make it, but if he misses one, I mean, I, I let him know about it if he misses one. All right, well, no offense. I'm going to take Team Ben here real quick because we did go 24 26 in the game the other, and you had the yeah, two misses. I, I did. So, two misses. Um, right. but, but Jake Nagus, 1,000 career points, plenty more to come. He's only a junior. Uh, big win last night. Thanks for joining me. Thank you. Thank you.